Greetings and salutations. Let, I'm just going to show what I'm working on, and I'm actually having some issues with uh, it works, but it doesn't work, and it, it, it really needs another block. What I what I need is, uh, but let me show you. I haven't wired in the floor yet, but I put a blast. I didn't realize that they put a, uh, a blast door in the last patch. And it's, you know, it's it's high hit points. It's like 3,200 hit points, so it's perfect. It, it works exactly what I need. And uh, the problem is the SV. And so my goal is, though, right, it's supposed to be a drop pod. So I can drop down. Well, it's not, it's, it's not triggered, unfortunately. There we go. Let me get out of this again. So the, the idea is that. You know, I'll I'll wire all this up, or I'll signal it all up, and then so once I enter the cockpit, of uh, the door opens up, and I can drop pod down to the surface. That's that's the the goal is it's supposed to be a drop pod, and then of course I can uh, retrieve it. You know, get back in my. So when you're playing on the multiplayer server, you could you could roll up, and so you could roll up. The camera view on this, I really wish you could just cycle through views. Like if you added a camera block, you could just be like top view, you know, and it would change your it would change your view to where I mean the rotate camera is nice, but it's not you need those directional cameras. And so this is this is kind of what I'm what I'm what I'm working trying to work out is uh, kind of a drop pod scenario like this. And so that's not what I meant to do. I meant to jump out. And ideally, if I could get this and see how it kicked me out. So ideally, if I could get this to where it fit inside of one cube is what I'm, what I'm trying to do is get it to fit inside of one cube to where, but the problem is, is the seats. You know, if I look at my cockpit selection, if I look at my cockpit selection, uh, it's kind of limited. You know, if I could rotate maybe one of these upright, uh, but it doesn't give you that ability to rotate one upright. Uh, and none of them are small enough to do to do an upright cockpit, like a drop pod upright cockpit. And I think if I if I could get that somehow, and I know there's in the menu there's a passenger, um, a passenger. Where did it go? I gotta click on SV. The the problem in general would see like this passenger seat would be perfect if uh, if I could somehow control it or somehow get it to work right. But let's see. Um, so it's two. See, if I could get a co oh, see, that's exactly four, um, which would work if if four by four, if it had controls, you know, as a as a drop pod, um, right? And so if I could just somehow let me access it, so I have no control over it. And if they could, if I could just get this graphic, this four by four graphic, because it would fit, it would still fit. I could make it longer. And uh, and if I could get con a drop pod cockpit with this this shape, to where um, you know even if I had to set a uh, a trajectory, you know, or figure out some way to set up some kind of signal to where I could drop this thing so my friend could be in it, because the only way to do that right now, let me remove this, is I'm going to show you something. And then the only way to get to drop that drop. So if you have your friends and you're playing multiplayer, and you want to drop that that pod, here, let's do this. You gotta hit P, and then I gotta set it to. Uh, it's on public. Let's set it on private, right? And then hit P, and I gotta set this to private. Okay. And then I think I think there's a way to make a faction. Uh, uh, human, I forget how to make, create, blah, right, blah, okay, set, okay, now I'm part of the blah faction, okay, so, so if I, if I, 
hit P, and the, but the effect that I'm looking for, okay, I'm going to set it to the blah faction, right? And so if I kick this back to private, it should drop. It should drop this drop power. Let me see device power. Maybe maybe it doesn't do it in um, creative mode, but it it'll normally it just drops off it just falls off and maybe they fix that but a way to uh have it fall off you know a way to um if you have your friends you can um through controllers you know through the device so i can be over here and i could just hit p and then i could just release pods and the pods would fall down like i could you know i could um and then my, I could fly by while I'm in the cockpit. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to figure out a way to, as I'm flying and I hit P, right, I get over the target, ideally. So I'm doing a, um, I'm doing a, um, I can't even think of the word, right? Come on. Why, why are we so, there we go. It seems like it's slowing down super slow. Okay, so I'm over the target. You know, of course, once you add the, uh, the, the camera blocks that I've been, talking about right so you i could just technically you just hit v and cycle through the the block that i added for camera view to the bottom of it and i could look straight down like a bombing a bombing run type of view right instead of hitting uh instead of hitting alt so basically i get over it the idea is i get oh come on i get over it right get over it and then i could hit hit p for panel and i could the signal that I set up, you know, I could click this, and my pod, my pod would drop with my buddies in it, you know, and then uh, the pods would drop down to the ground, and it would release, it would release the pods. And so if I, if I could figure out how to do that, uh, you know, I know you can do it from, I know, and if I just hit private. See if it drops. See if it drops down here. Uh, it doesn't. But in, I think I think in the on the vanilla servers they'll fall they'll fall off. If I hit P, maybe I gotta uh, let's try this. Maybe that's the key. Maybe they, if they're both on faction, and then I hit P, right? I kind of look in the bottom corner there underneath the look down here in the thing. If I hit okay, and then I set this back to private. I expect it to drop that that um, that pot out of there, and so that's what I'm trying to figure out how to do. Is maybe it's got to have power. Is do some kind of pod drop. Uh, let's try this. Let me see. Right, this is set to faction. This is set to faction. So if I go like this and I hit private. See, I, I think in multiplayer it does that. It the pod the pod falls off. Anyways, back to my kind of my talking point here. Um, I need a cockpit that is a thinner uh, scale so it fits it fits in a um, a one by a one you know basically it's a four by four small small um, or a one by one large, so it it will the the cockpit with the thrusters, everything combined. It's okay if it's like eight tall or whatever, you know, eight blocks tall. But it it'll 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 basically I can line up, and then release it from a uh, signal logic or something, and it can be a type of drop pod, um, you know. And I think I think those same logic later on can be implemented in bombs you know if you wanted to set up like a bomber run or if you wanted to set up some kind of uh, ground attack um, you know it just adds a lot more whatever whatever you can do to flush out the creative mode to where you're constantly building more complex situations to um, overcome complex obstacles would be a bit big benefit to the game and I think this is more of one of those more complex scenarios where it, it definitely takes a level of game design to implement some of these policies um, but yeah I, I, was, I was trying to see if I could do it and I, I've kind of gotten close 
but there's a few things that are not implemented correctly. Um, you know, you got the landing gear, which is obviously part of it, and then the seats. The seats, uh, you know, I can do the long seat. The problem is it doesn't really – I'd have to do a, a, a two-by-six or, you know, a two, a lar two large blocks to get it to fall through. Um, come on, close. There you go. So I like – I really like this concept, this design. You know, I really like how he's got these blast doors, and then um, I don't know if, if anybody has a solution or knows a way to uh, release release drop pods uh, and kind of you know, and they can use the existing, they can use the passenger seat and just put it, you know, use the same graphic, use the same asset, so that way, just give it a couple other, pr uh, pr um, you know, put it in. Put it in the um, cockpit menu when you right click. You put it in the cockpit menu, but put it as a drop pod only. And uh, you know, maybe maybe the solution is is all that it does is you lose your left and right controls, or you lose your um, you lose your controls, but you have the ability to access the uh, the landing gear or something. You know, I'm not asking for asset creation, but just a little bit more. Uh, options in the creative mode um, definitely a solution i've been trying to figure out how to work myself around all right thanks for watching